Hey, this is Drew Gallagher, and today I'm going to tell you all about social media marketing, so don't go anywhere. Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Drew Gallagher, helping you to accelerate your life and your business. So you want to learn about social media marketing? Well, let me tell you, social media marketing is the future. Before we get into it, I'd love you to smash that like button and click the subscribe button. Click the little bell icon and turn on all notifications so you don't miss a video when I release it. Why market on social media? Well, if you are a brand or you're a business with a product that is targeted to people that are on social media, then it might be in your best interest to do social media marketing. Who uses social media? Well, these days, anybody with a smartphone that's trying to consume entertaining, inspiring, or educational content probably has a social media app that they use. If you're looking for older demographics, you probably want to gravitate toward Facebook. If you're looking for younger demographics, you definitely want to go on TikTok or Instagram. Social media marketing is about putting out content that inspires, educates, or entertains people in order to build trust with a community. The goal is to find audiences that are interested in your niche and then to be able to build trust with them. Once you build their trust with your content that you're providing them, you can start forming a business relationship with them where you can sell products. For example, you could start an Instagram business page and let's say you wanna sell jewelry. You could start posting memes about jewelry and inspiration about being elegant and taking pride. This way you can build your brand and you can make yourself trustworthy in the eyes of the customer. Then you can put a link in your bio and you can start driving customers into your business funnel. It's also really important to think about the nature and behavior of consumers on these different platforms. When you see people scrolling through Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, you see that they're just trying to see something that catches their eye. So that's the kind of content you wanna create. Whereas on YouTube, people go there for long form content. So you can expect people wanting to see really long videos. YouTube is also exclusive to video. So if you have a bunch of pictures you want to show off, you're going to have to create it in a video format to use YouTube as a good platform for you. It's really important to keep the end in mind when you're trying to figure out how to market to your consumer. In order to create the customer journey, you need to understand what your product is and who's going to want it. If you're trying to sell expensive jewelry, you're probably going to want older women that have money to spend and are really interested in jewelry. And you're gonna wanna create content that can appeal to them. Maybe a lot of the buyers are mothers, or maybe they're women in positions of power so they have a lot of money. Maybe they're just very fashionable and they love different fashion brands. You should post content related to these topics and you should research using keyword tools in order to figure out what exactly they're searching for and what kinds of content they're looking for. If you want me to make a video about how you can research keywords, leave a comment below, I'd be glad to. The amazing thing about social media marketing is when you use ad platforms like Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube ads, you can really target people very well. The tools allow you to narrow down your target audience super easily and at a low cost. No longer do you have to worry about paying thousands of dollars to get a TV slot and you don't even know if your target audience is going to be there on that channel. With ad platforms such as Facebook, you can narrow down by age, interests, different pages that they've liked. You can narrow based on their income. You can even narrow down to the device types that they prefer to use. Location, gender, the list goes on and on. You should look at different brands that are similar to yours and see what content they're producing. You should try to check out trends and figure out what people are looking for. Then your content strategy for social media should revolve around that. You wanna create one piece of content and then repurpose it for all the platforms. What do I mean by repurpose? The same post on Instagram isn't probably gonna work very well on YouTube. If you want to do a video on Instagram, it can only be one minute. YouTube, you can have a really long video. So you would want to convey your message much differently because users on Instagram are trying to scroll through their feed really fast. So you want to get their attention. Whereas on YouTube, you want to have more of a discussion. Maybe on YouTube, you do a full product review of the latest and greatest. But then on Instagram, maybe you do a short review and you just try to catch people's attention and entertain them, educate them, or inspire them. You can keep the same topic though for the content. This way you don't have to worry about creating different content ideas for each platform. You can just start with an idea and then branch it off and change it just a little bit for each platform. Always keep the consumer in mind and you'll succeed as a marketer. Social media is not so scary to market on once you understand how it works. I suggest you dive into the platforms. Download TikTok, download Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Pinterest, and just figure out how they work. If you're already a user on the platform, try to see how brands interact with it. It's much different. Then try to model their success. Modeling is the best way to reproduce success. I hope you enjoyed this video on social media marketing and I hope you start diving into the platforms. If you want me to make more videos on social media marketing or ad platforms, leave a comment below with yes. I'd be happy to do that. Thanks for tuning in. Peace out. Hey, thank you so much for watching my video. I really appreciate it. If you liked the content in this video and want to see more videos like this, 
please click the subscribe button. Make sure to click the little bell icon and turn on all notifications so when I come out with new content, you'll be notified.